Hey guys, my name is Annie Cooper with Tune Into Fitness, and today I'm gonna to be taking you through a 10 minute back and arm circuit. So all you need for this workout is a set of dumbbells, I'm using 15 pounds here, and one long resistance band. So this long band is going to be a latex band. I have the second up from the lightest that came in the package. So you need a band, set of dumbbells, and let's get started. So what I want you guys to do first is we're gonna warm up our backs, our arms, warm up our whole body. So go ahead and reach down. We're gonna twist the side, rotate our arm out, and then go ahead and twist the opposite side. So you should feel a nice stretch in the side of your back, your hips, your hamstrings. All right, other side. And let's do that one more time. All right, guys, I hope you're ready for this workout. It's gonna be short and sweet. We're gonna get this done quick, and then you can get on with the rest of your day. All right, guys, so go ahead and push those knees out, and we're gonna twist our back. So you're gonna push against the opposite knee, twist, switch to the other side. Let's do that one more time. My back cracks every time when I do this one. Switch to the other side. All right, feet together. Let's shake out those arms back and forth. All right, up and down. You can do a longer warm up if you want to, but we're doing a nice and short warm up for a short workout. Face the side, last thing. We're gonna touch our toes, stand up, touch the toes, stand up. Two more, stand up, last one. All right, guys, so go ahead and stretch a little bit more if you want to. I'm gonna show you guys what we're doing. So we're gonna do a super set of two movements at a time, two times through, and then we're gonna switch to the next thing. So what we're gonna start with is the band. So what I want you to do, you're gonna sit on your butt for the first thing. We're gonna put the band on the back of our feet. All right, so we're looping both sides around the band and we're starting with seated rows, all right? So we're starting with 15 seated rows here. Right after that, all you're going to do is you're going to take one side of the band off here, we're gonna loop our hands around and we're gonna do face pull. So now you're gonna pull up, all right? So we're doing rows down. We're loosening in it, rows up, 15 of each. Let's go in five, four, shoulders back, three, two, one. And let's do it, one, two. Sit up nice and tall, you should feel your back with this one. Three, four, five, six, seven. Be happy with these, it will get harder. Nine, 10, five more, 11, 12, keep those feet flexed, 13, 14, 15, take one side of the band off, one side is still gonna be on the back of the feet, and we're gonna do face pull, so hands will be this way, 15, you should feel this in the rear delts, and the upper back, three, four, five, six, there we go, you should feel that burn, Eight, nine, ten, last five. Perfect. Four, three, two, last one. Straighten your elbows all the way. All right, and one more time. Let's move both around the feet. Fifteen, grabbing both sides of the band. Seated rows. One, two, last fifteen of these. Three, four, keep those abs nice and tight as well. Five, six, seven eight, nine, come on, keep going, 10, last five, four, three more, you should feel those arms and the back, two, last one, all right, take one side off, last time of face pulls, and then we are going ahead, standing up, 15, one, two, finish these out strong, make sure you're breathing, five, six, seven, eight, here we go. Nine, try not to rock your body. You want to stay stable. 11, almost done. 12, 13, 14, last one. 15, nice, all right. Take that band off, go ahead and stand up and we're gonna grab our dumbbells for this next one. All right, so grab the dumbbells. We're going to do bent over rows, two different variations, all right? So same thing, I'm gonna show you the superset and then we'll go ahead and get started. So you want to bend your knees, back is flat here. Dumbbells are slightly in front of your knees. We're gonna do bent over rows. So we're gonna go straight, and then you're gonna rotate your hands underhand, just like that. All right, so we're gonna go five of each, and then we're doing renegade rows. So you're in a plank position on the dumbbells, and we're rowing one dumbbell towards our hips here. All right, so we have 10 of those. So we're going five of each for the first one, 10 for the second. Let's go in five, four, three, two, one, let's do it straight, five of each, one, rotate underhand. Remember, stay stable with this one, two, 
two, three, three, four, four, last one, five, underhand, five, nice. Go ahead and put those dumbbells on the ground in a push-up position. Make sure you're breathing on these, your core stays tight, and let's go for 10. Pull those shoulders back. Try not to rock your hips too much. Four, five. You should feel the core, the arms. Six, seven, eight. Two more. Nine, last one. And there you go, drop it down to your knees. Wait a couple seconds, give yourself a little bit of a break. I know you feel your arms with this one. And we're going one more set of each. Give ourselves about 10 more seconds rest. We're getting into the next one. I don't know why I'm using 15 pounds, it's a little heavy, but if you have 10 pounds, you can switch to those. If you wanna go heavier than that, you can go to 20 or 25, but 15 is plenty for me. All right, guys, let's go in five, four, three, two, one. Bent over rows, straight. Underhand, one, two, two, three. Make sure you're breathing, back is flat. Four, shoulders are pinched back. Last one, five, underhand, five, perfect. All right, go ahead and get into that plank position one more time. We're going 10 renegade rows in three, two, one. Let's do it, one, two, three, four, five, perfect. Six, seven, eight, two more. Nine, last one. 10, put those down. Give yourself a couple seconds rest. We're gonna go into our next superset. So this next one is gonna be somewhat simple for the first move, a little bit more challenging for the second move. All right, so we're gonna incorporate a little bit of legs, not much, it's gonna be mostly upper body, but you will feel your legs a little bit. So what we're doing for the next movement is we're going to do single arm rows, okay? So you're gonna have, pick a leg, whichever leg you wanna put forward first. I'm gonna have my left leg forward first. We're gonna go single arm rows with one arm here. So my, my opposite arm is resting on my knee for stability and we're rowing all the way up to our hips and straightening that elbow all the way. All right guys, so that's one movement there. The second movement, all we're gonna do is grab the side of our dumbbell, straighten out this mat a little bit. The side of our dumbbell, we're gonna get into a low squat, elbows out in front of you and we're gonna do curls to our forehead and back down, all right? And we're gonna stay in that low squat. So you will feel your legs a little bit, but you'll also feel it a little bit more in the biceps, all right? So we're going 10 and 10 for these, okay? So let's do it in five. Pick an arm, pick a leg, four, three, two, one, 10 single arm rows. One, two, three, four. I'm sweating now, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, switch to the opposite side, and let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, 10, grab the side of that dumbbell. We're going squat, low squat, curls, and let's do it, 10. And you wanna keep those elbows out in front of you. Pay attention to where my elbows are, four, Five, you'll feel your biceps more. Keep holding six, seven, eight, last two, nine, one more. Nice job, put that down. Wait a couple seconds, catch your breath. We're doing that one more time. I am dripping in sweat, I hope you guys are too. We got one more set of that. Let's go in five seconds. Four, pick that dumbbell up. Three, two, one, let's do it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Switch to the other side. Last time a single arm rose. Now let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Low squat to curls. Grab the sides of that dumbbell. And let's do it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, we're finishing out with our burnout. We are almost done with this workout already. I know it's quick. Grab those dumbbells. We're gonna do three separate things. 
We're gonna do row, curl, press it up, tricep extension. We got five of those. Grab your dumbbells, I'll wait for you. Let's go in five, four, three, two, one. Let's do it. Bent over row, curl, tricep extension. That's one, four more. Row, curl, tricep extension. That's two. Make sure you're breathing. Tricep extension, that's three. Curl, triceps, that's four. One more. Row, curl, triceps, that's five. Last thing, super quick. We're going 10 supermans and then you're finished. So we're gonna go ahead and lay on your stomach, hands out in front of you, legs up. We're gonna pull straight back for 10, nine, eight, everything's up, seven, six, five, four, three, squeeze that back together, two, one, and release. You guys are done. Nice job on this quick, quick workout. If you wanna repeat this again and add two, three, four more sets, go for it by all means. But thank you guys so much for tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe and let me know what you wanna see next down below. And I'll see you guys next time.